Hi guys, I'm trying to make these rocking seagulls solar powered. I'm just using two of them now. I've taken the third one off. I'll explain why in a second. To make them solar powered, I've got the circuit board out of one of my normal solar rockers, one of those solar rocking snowmen or something like that. Can't remember what it came from originally. The coil that attracts or repels the magnets is actually underneath this grey stand. I'll show it to you in a minute. And because it's now 11 o'clock at night, we're running it off batteries instead of a solar panel. So the coil is attracting or repelling the magnet that's attached to the counterbalance for this one. And the effect of that rocking backwards and forwards is also making the other one move because that's got a neodymium magnet on it too. So they just sit there and rock away. I'll just move the camera so we can see a bit closer. So that's the circuit board. You can see the neodymium magnet on the counterbalance on both of them. And then if I lift this out of the way, that's the coil that would normally be in my rocking snowman or whatever solar mover it was. So you can see these move perfectly well with the slightest bit of movement. They'll take quite a while to settle down. And even if I hold them because they've got big, big neodymium magnets on them. If I hold one still, as soon as I let it go, because the other one's moving, it starts it moving again. But if I just position that over that coil, try and stop them both. It's very difficult to stop them because as soon as you move your hand, you start moving. Well, you can see that that one's being moved by the coil. If I let that one go, then they both move. It takes a little while for them to settle down into a rhythm. But that's my solar powered seagulls, or at least they would be solar powered if it was sunny. But if I try and put all three together, all that happens is they just lock up straight away. So I just can't use three together. I'm going to speed up the camera a bit here so you can see the way the magnets interact with each other and the magnetic field from the coil. So one moves, that makes the other one move, that makes the first one move and they they play off each other I think is the easiest way to put it. But it's easiest to see if I speed the film up. So this is about 20 minutes of film and I'll probably do it 10 times speed.